Good morning, or afternoon, or evening. We're back for our vlog, and today we are going to talk about more of our decluttering, what we've been able to accomplish this week, and just how much more there is still to go. No matter how much we get rid of, it's it feels never ending. It's like a tidal wave of junk. Yeah, we were talking about some of the stuff we've gotten rid of recently. We we're looking around and we're like, wow, that's empty. That used to have a bunch of stuff up there, but we still have a bunch of stuff bunch left. Of stuff. Yeah, we did the pantry this week. I'll throw some photos up of what it looked like when we started, and then I'll put some photos of what it looks like now, and it's a, a big difference. It, it definitely has cleared up a lot. Yeah, I wish we could still get it to even more clear <laughs> than it is now. But it's a great start. Yeah, great start. Yeah, I agree. Sabrina found a great website this week called freecycle.org and it was a great way to donate some of the things that we no longer needed to somebody else that could find value from them. So I basically created a profile on this website. I saw a listing for somebody that actually needed some household items and I wrote her on there, basically went by email. I wrote her and just let her know, hey, I've got a bunch of stuff that we wanted to donate. If you'd like them, we have them. And I also posted my own post saying that I had a bunch of household items if they wanted them, dishes, pots, that type of thing, um, that we had duplicates of. Bookshelf, yeah. silverware, a lot of plates. Shoe rack. Since I've gotten rid of a lot of the shoes yeah, that I never rid. really liked in the first place, they were just kind of sitting there. So had a bunch of shoes, didn't really wear, so let's buy a shoe rack and put them on. And once we got rid of those, then we had some space in the shoe rack, so we gave that away too. Yeah. But it was pretty easy. We met with the person, of course, in a public area because these aren't people you really know. And so we met with her, we dropped off the stuff, and she seemed super grateful yeah, for it. So. She was like, I don't care what you're giving me. I don't care if they say hello kitty on them. We still have a few things left that we're supposed to meet someone else today, today yeah. to give some more dishes and utensils and that type of thing away and kind of go from there. So one thing I did do this week was I actually checked out the minimalism documentary which I actually pre-ordered a couple months ago, but haven't had time to watch it. So I finally watched it this week. Awesome documentary, I liked it. And if you're into minimalism or into decluttering and simplifying and kind of getting a hold of what really matters to you in your life, then I'd recommend this documentary for anybody. And so we're actually gonna re-watch it. I'll watch it tonight, I haven't, haven't seen it yet. Seen it yet. So, so I, I listen to their podcast and I like them on the podcast. They, they have a lot of great information. Yeah, yeah. so we'll do that later. So. Now I think that's it. Just a brief vlog on where we're at this week and we'll kind of keep you guys updated. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks. Comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And even better, share. Yeah, please share. <laughs> please share. <laughs> All right. Take care. Thanks. What?